Hey guys, it's Lam here again, your tech guide. And today's video, we are going to do a heart rate comparison test with my oximeter and the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2. So we're going to see if this watch is accurate when it comes to checking our heart rate. So we're going to be testing this out with my oximeter which I use um, for work. And uh, we're gonna probably do like three tests and just see what kind of range we will be getting out of it. If the difference is between two to three increments, it should be okay. But if it's more than that, then of course it's not accurate guys. So let's activate our heart rate here. And at the same time, I'm gonna put that on. Okay. And we're gonna press measure. So here we go, guys. So my heart rate on the oximeter is 88. It's gonna fluctuate, guys. All right, so 88 uh -oh. and then 83, 82 on the oximeter. Like I said, it will fluctuate my heart rate. So we are at 86, 87 there. 84. So it will also take an effect when I am talking, the heart rate should rise up. As you can see, we are at 84, 85. So let's do that again. Another one, we'll take another test here. Measure. So I will continue to talk so that both devices will, um, will somewhat pick up that, the, that my heart is working extra hard. So we are at 91 on the oximeter and on the watch, we are at 76. So that is way uh -oh. off right there, guys. Way off. All right, so let's do another one. So 85, 84 on the oximeter. And we should be getting a reading anytime soon now on the watch. We are at 84. So five, so three increments. From the oximeter so it's not too bad not too bad so let's do one more and hopefully we'll get the steady result so at least that we know that the watch is quite accurate so we are at 90 right now we're just waiting on the watch 88 so that's a little bit off there guys uh -oh. 89 99 too so Oh, okay, so yeah, it's a little bit off. So we'll do it one more time, guys. One more time. One more time and see if this is accurate or not. 92, 93. And we should be getting a result now on the watch. My wrist is starting to get hurt here. 88. So, a little bit off there, guys. Just a tad off. All right, so that's just a quick video test, guys. If you want to see the accuracy of the watch when you compare it to an oximeter. And if you have any other questions, just leave me a comment down below. And once again, thank you for watching my video. Until then, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.